Welcome, in front of me is a Oppo Reno 10 Pro and today I'll show you how you can enable and set up your do not disturb mode. To get started we're going to pull down our notifications by swiping down from the top of our screen, then swipe down once again to extend the list of toggles. Now obviously we're looking for the do not disturb toggle, if you don't see it on the first page you can swipe to the left and this will show you a second page where the toggle is located for me. Now once you see it, if you're doing this the first time, I recommend holding it. This will give you this pop-up right here and can select more, which will take us to the settings. Here we will be able to customize how the Do Not Disturb Mode functions. And I'm going to touch upon a couple options that I find important or just good. So number one, we have a schedule. Here is one that, I, that comes pre-made with the device. You can obviously change it if you want, so you can create your uh, own one new ones by tapping right here. You can name it whatever you want. You can select start, end time and also day of the week that you wanted to repeat during. And from there you can check mark it and as you can see it automatically adds it and enables it. This will then automatically turn on and off at the provided time. And to use the schedule mode all you need to make sure is that it is enabled here. And that's all you would do. The device will do everything else for you. But for the people that want to use their do not disturb mode occasionally and just manually toggle it on, uh, you can set it all up right here. So I'm gonna go to the next page, part, which is the people. Here you can select who can call you or message you. We have none, favorite or contacts. Then we can also add exclusions for applications. And below that you have ring for repeated callers, which affects who can call you. And if someone calls you twice within a three minute period, so uh, if they meet this requirement, and this is obviously enabled, uh, they will be completely bypassing whatever you have selected in people. So it might be a bit of an annoying option though. The requirements for this are very strict as you can see. Two, two calls in three minutes is pretty extensive. So this might be a pretty good option to have enabled in terms of emergencies. Usually people will just try to spam call you till you pick up. Uh, so this will allow them to bypass whatever you have selected here. Now that being said, these are all the worth mentioning settings. So I'm going to close this now and find the toggle. And from here I can just press on it and select turn on. And there we go. Or do not disturb mode is now enabled. Now one important thing to keep in mind is when you manually enable it, it will run indefinitely in the background till you turn it off. So that being said, once you're done with it, you do want to remember to turn it off and you would do so by just finding a toggle and the top on it once more. Another thing you could do to uh, have like an automatic turn off, even if you forget about it, is to go into the settings and under schedule create one that is like a minute long. So as an example you can make it every day whatever that's good enough starting at 10 p.m. and for instance oops and it ending at 10.01 p.m. This would make it so it will turn on for exactly one minute and if your do not disturb mode is enabled prior to that so if it's enabled, then 10 p.m. rolls around. Obviously, you cannot enable it twice, so it's just going to stay on. And then once we have 10.01, it will turn it off. So that's a good option to have in case you tend to forget about such a thing. You can set it up for just like one minute and it will try to turn it off every single day. Now, that being said, it will be enabled for one minute per day. So, um, so you might want to, for instance, make it a different time, like... I don't know, 2 a.m. or something like that, if you want. That could be a little bit more useful. But anyway, with this being said, hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.